Many times when uh, a coaching client of mine is going on their very first fearless agent listing presentation, or maybe their very first listing presentation, they say, what's the advice you can give me before I go? And I always give them the same advice. I always say, care about the customer and don't care about getting the listing. If you only cared about the customer and helping your customer sell their house for more than it's worth, you would ask different questions. You would ask better questions. You would ask more questions. And it would look like you cared about the customer. And when you only care about the customer, you're going to get the listing. And when you only care about getting the listing, the customer's going to recognize that, and you're probably not going to get the listing. I had a coaching student of mine. He's been in real estate as of today 18 days. So I've been coaching him for 16 days, and he just took his first listing at 7%. What was a 1.2 million fair market value property. He listed it for 999, got a one-year listing at 7%, and he keeps four in New York City. Now, how did that happen? Well, it's never happened ever in the state of New York ever before. Not a single agent in the state of New York, I'll bet, has ever taken a listing for one that's worth 1.2, and the seller begged them to price it at 999, and they got 7% in a one-year listing. So how did it happen to him? He's a fearless agent. And when you're a fearless agent, you sit on a throne made of the skulls of your enemies. Anything is possible. You don't have to put up with the baloney that other people do. So he's going to get a very big paycheck, and he deserves it and his seller is going to sell their house for way more than it's worth. If you'd like to be able to do that, you can call me at the number down here. You can go to fearlessagent.com anytime and watch our free webinar. And if it looks like what we do is a good fit for you, we can't wait to make you a fearless agent. Thanks.